actually know what to do for this gig because uh, my normal sound up is a different vibe. Isabel, who runs this gig, she also runs Comedy Club for Kids. So I spoke to the children and I said to them, what would make a good Edinburgh Fringe show? I will read to you what they said would make a good Edinburgh Fringe show. Uh, they've called it The Comedy Show. <laughs> I'm a manager of the place. Um, uh, here is what is going to happen. Spoiler alert. Here is what is going to happen. A man is on stage doing funny stuff. <laughs> and more funny stuff. Including miming throwing strawberries at people. <laughs> then he gets stung by a bee on the bum. <laughs> then goes straight to sleep on stage. <laughs> there is also an otter. <laughs> Let's go. Please welcome. To, oh, I should say, uh, I get paid ten pounds for this gig. The costumes are reflective of that fee. <laughs> Please welcome to the stage, Ann Otter. much man as long as we can have access to one drawer that's all we need one drawer the man drawer this isn't a drawer that we will earmark early on a drawer will become available we will tensively inquire as its usage darling are you going to use this drawer? <laughs> no. Can I have it? This will be my man drawer. And that's our little zone in the house. And we will fill it with things that we think we need. There will be light bulbs in the drawer. If a light bulb goes in the drawer, man will check his drawer for stock. There will be batteries of indeterminate light scattered through the man drawer. When a battery runs out, we don't throw it away. We're too lazy for that. Just fling it in the man drawer. Adds a little bit of excitement. Next time we need to find a battery. Instructions for appliances we don't even own anymore. They'll be in the man drawer. Sometimes wedging it shut. I have, alongside keys from my home, I don't even live in anymore. There is something too mysterious about a key.